Hi, I'm Donna Joy from Social Media Bomb, and today I want to ask you a question. I want to ask you, are you on the road to success or are you on the path to insanity? I know that's a funny question, but let's look at the definition of what insanity is, which is doing the same thing over and over again, expecting a different result. Now, success comes from consistently doing the same actions and over and over again. So how do we know when what we're doing is going to lead to our success? And how do we know when we're just going crazy? Well, I had a good think about it when this came to me the other day and I've come up with five different ways that we can know we're on the path to success. Okay, so the first way is that the path to success is uncomfortable because we're stretching ourselves, we're pushing ourselves, we're putting ourselves out there. We're doing things that we haven't done before. We're learning things that we haven't known before and it's uncomfortable. And this is where part of our problem comes from because our brain is very persuasive and very convincing. And when we get into discomfort, it starts to tell us things. It starts to tell us that we can't do it, that we're not good enough, that no one's gonna listen, that everyone's gonna laugh at us. And we start telling us these things and it starts convincing us to switch tactics, to try something else, to back away from what we're doing, to take ourselves out of discomfort. But if you're in discomfort, that's a great thing because it means that you're heading in the right direction. So just keep going, okay? Don't listen to your brain when it tells you that you're going insane. Just keep on going. Now, the second thing is that the path to insanity comes from just normally doing one thing over and over and over and over again, expecting a different result from that thing. In contrast, the path to success comes from the synergistic energy that's created when a strategic system is consistently performed. So success comes from us working out a, a strategy and a system and putting that in place and doing it consistently. It's not just doing the one thing over and over and over again. Now, the third reason you'll know that on your right path is that success may not happen overnight, but it does come incrementally. So you should be starting to have some early wins. You should be starting to see some things happening. You should be getting some engaged. You might have some people getting your opt-ins. You might have some people coming onto your calendar. It may be just small initially, but if it's happening, if things are starting to move, if you're starting to push that rock up the hill and starting to see some stuff happening, then you're on the right path. So just keep going. Now, success also does not come from second guessing yourself consistently. It does not come from changing your mind all the time and from doing something once and then trying something else. It comes from putting a play into place and following it through for long enough that you can get some results that you can sit back and analyze those results and then tweak what you're doing and then go back in there. So success comes from taking emotion out of it, okay? From stop knee-jerk reaction when bad things happen, from being able to carry out what you're doing for long enough that you can actually look at the results and study and use them to see whether or not what you're doing needs to be altered. Now, the last place that success comes from, the fifth place, is it comes from being around long enough for the people that you want to help, for them to see that you really are the leader for them. So there's a lot of people who will be watching you and be waiting you and be studying what you're doing. And they're nervous because, you know, they may have put their trust in other people before. They may have been watching other thought leaders before. And then those people just disappeared because they gave up. So success grows and grows. And one of the reasons it grows is because the longer you're in the game, the longer that you're there, the more content you're putting out, the more social proof you're creating, the more people you're going to be drawing towards you. So imagine you're like a magnet. And you're able to, magnets able to pull things from long distances, but it takes a long time for those things to get to you. But the longer you're there as that magnet, the more and more things are going to come towards you. And that's what happens if you're doing the right thing in your business, in your online marketing. Okay, so that's the difference between success and insanity and how you can tell if you're doing the right thing. Now, if you'd like some help putting together your online marketing system, that's exactly what Steph and I are doing in Boomers. We're helping people and showing them how to set up the client getting machine. So if you'd like to have a talk about that, just jump on our calendar. I'll put the link with this video uh, and we look forward to talking to you soon.